About 90% of artifacts belonging to Africa are being illegally held in Western museums and libraries. Welcome to Tuna Cheki and in today's video, we will look at some of the top 10 priceless African artifacts stolen from Africa. Before we get into the video, remember to subscribe and ring the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of our videos. Number 10. Tomb of Tutankhamun also known as King Tut, King Tutankhamun was an ancient Egyptian pharaoh and son to King Akhenaten. His tomb was significant as it was used to record what Egyptian tombs looked like. Its estimated value is well over $1.2 million. Number 9. Bango Queen, Cameroon, Germany, France the Bangwa Queen is a sculpture of great spiritual importance to the Bangwa, a people indigenous to the western part of Cameroon. The wooden carving represents the power and health of the Bangwa. At an estimated value of $4 million, the sculpture was looted by German colonialists and later given to the Dapper Foundation in Paris, France. Number 8. Babwe Birds, Zimbabwe, Germany, Britain. The Zimbabwe birds are stone-carved birds found in the ruins of the ancient city of Great Zimbabwe. The birds were looted by both Germany and Britain and up to date, only 8 of the birds were ever recovered with a total estimated value of $5 million. Number 7. Savo Man Eaters, Kenya, Britain, USA the Savo man-eaters were a pair of man-eating male lions in the Savo region of Kenya, which were responsible for the deaths of dozens of construction workers on the Kenya-Uganda railway. The lion skins were sold to the American Field Museum of Natural History by Britain for a sum of $5,000 in 1924, and today accounting for inflation would be estimated to be a whooping $84 million. Number 6. 18th century Ethiopian crown Ethiopia The 18th century crown which has great religious significance went missing from a church in Ethiopia 20 plus years ago but was returned by the Dutch government to the Ethiopian government its value is priceless number 5 knock terracotta heads Nigeria USA these are sculptures made of terracotta that portray human heads, human figures and animals found in Nigeria. They are believed to be the earliest sculptures produced in Africa. The heads are currently on display in the Metropolitan Museum of Art with each estimated at about $1 million. Number 4. Akan Gold Weights, Ghana, Britain, Scotland. Depicting important proverbs and symbols from Akan culture, Akan gold weights illuminate intricacies of a complex society and historical networks of commerce. Some of the gold weights are currently on display at the National Museums in Scotland. There were some estimated 3 million gold weights with an average weight of 3 ounces, totaling to current gold value of $15 billion. Number 3. The Rosetta Stone, Egypt, France, Britain. The Rosetta Stone is a stone composed of granodiorite inscribed with three versions of a decree issued in Memphis, Egypt in 196 BC. It is currently on display in the British Museum London, having passed into British hands after the French surrender of Egypt in 1801. This stone has no value and it is priceless. Number 2. Nefertiti Bust, Egypt, Germany The Nefertiti Bust is a bust of Nefertiti, the great royal wife of Egyptian pharaoh Akhenaten. It is one of the most copied works of ancient Egypt. It was looted in 1912 by a German team and is currently on display at the News Museum in Berlin. The bust today cannot be measured in value, the insurance values is in the tens of millions but the original bust remains a priceless treasure. And the number one most priceless African wax of art stolen from Africa goes to Benin Bronzes. The Benin Bronzes are priceless pieces of art that come from the ancient kingdom of Benin, now in southern Nigeria. 
Benin bronzes include carved elephant tusks and ivory, leopard statues and wooden heads. And an estimated 10,000 bronzes were stolen, so the total value should be $47 billion. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, follow, share and like our video. It's the best way of supporting us. You can directly support us by becoming our YouTube member, Patreon or donor. And remember, Africa is watching.